President Joe Biden and former President Donald Trump are close to securing their party's nomination ahead of the general election this fall. And both men campaigned this weekend, but a new poll finds voters are split on who they trust to do a better job. ABC's Ike Giacci has more. President Biden and Donald Trump both visiting the battleground state of Georgia on Saturday, taking aim at one another. Donald Trump and the MAGA Republicans are trying to take our freedoms away. You're destroying our country, Joe. The latest ABC News Ipsos poll finds Americans are split, with 33% saying they trust President Biden to do a better job leading the U.S., while 36% say Donald Trump, and another 30% say neither. The poll also found just 33% of Americans have a favorable impression of Biden compared to 29% for Trump. These campaigns are going to have to give these voters something to vote for. They can't just say that they are uh, an option to vote against their opponent. Trump has been campaigning heavily on immigration. Uh, the border is the biggest problem. I think it's one of the biggest problems, the greatest threat to the history of our country. The last month, the former president urged Republicans to not pass any Biden-backed immigration legislation. Another important issue for many voters, the economy. During his State of the Union address, President Biden touting his administration's economic economic accomplishments. 15 million new jobs in just three years, a record. Unemployment at 50 year lows. Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg believes the president deserves more credit for the economic results he's delivered. It requires work to get that story out, especially when there's a fire hose of negativity uh, talking down the economy and trying to, to change the subject from the president's achievements, which, which is just politics. The president now heads to two more battleground states this week, Wisconsin and Michigan. Trump's plans this week have not been announced. Ike Giacci, ABC News, Washington.